This is a journey of me making a website that has no sitemap. And then later on down the line, realizing I need a sitemap because it's important for SEO. And luckily, I've built said static website using Next.js, so I can just add a sitemap. I can add a sitemap to the build process that I've got, which, uh, you know, it does a few things, but it deploys it to AWS. And what we want to do is make sure that every time it does a deploy to AWS, we're including a sitemap. Otherwise, how are those drones going to... Those crawlers, how are they going to find all the pages? The links, don't be daft. They need a sitemap. We've got the website on the left. We've got Next.js is kind of like basic layout here. You don't really need to know much about the actual website itself. But we have got the website open with our destination sitemap that we want our sitemap to be at. But at the minute, just getting an application error. So the crawlers, oh baby, those crawlers are not going to be liking that. So let's just check that we're installed. npm run dev. Yeah, if you look at that, client side error. We know that we need a sitemap and probably the easiest thing that we're going to be able to do is find one that someone else has made. Not a sitemap someone else has made, but a way to generate one that someone else has made. So I'm gonna take the first stop on npm.js, look at next hyphen sitemap. Signs are good, it looks like it's being actively maintained. And we've got a fair few downloads every week. So, signs are very strong. If we just cruise down here, if we just cruise down the uh, the npm page, we'll be able to see how difficult is it to get going. Install it, config file, add a post build script. Might be an issue on Windows machines. Blah blah blah. Let's give it a try. This guy is is favouring yarn very heavily there. But you don't need to use yarn. I'm not going to use yarn. Let's install this baby. Who is this chap? I am Vishnu Sankar. No, I'm not a fan of these uh, auto, these cartoon faces. I want to see the face of the man or woman or whoever else is helping me out here. It's a busy, busy person. Very busy. Right, so we've got it installed. If we go to dev dependencies now, we've got, what's it called? Night next sitemap. Right, so what else does he want? He wants, or she wants, what, hang on. Yeah, Next.js config file, new file. Oh, new file, Let's put it in there. Let's just get exactly what they're saying that they want. For now, we'll just use the example. Doesn't like that because it's maybe converted to ES. But we'll just, we'll allow that for now. And then, what, what is the deal? We just need post build, but we probably won't call it post build because we've got more than one post build thing going on. Call it sitemap. And is that is that it? Is that it? That seems very very straightforward. Okay, I'm run sitemap. And we've got some kind of error. It's never it's never straightforward. You never just install it. You never go. I want a sitemap. I'll find the first npm module, install that sucker, and then we're away. Never, never like that. Right. As a solution, uh, as, I mean, I could have just clicked on that and read through this, but I just happened to catch this. As a solution to this, it's now possible to pass, to use a custom config file instead of blah, blah. So now you can use a different name thing. 
and we'll call that and he shall call it config for it is a config and what do we need to do pass hyphen hyphen config and he shall run it once more and he shall be unable to locate the named thing a few moments later what's the dealio? next sitemap dot config let's, let's pinch that we'll just do what this chap this little chap's done He shall rename the file to be this and he shall rerun it and accidentally open Photoshop and be unable to close it and it has closed. Alright, unable to find export maker, make sure to build a project. Ah. Oh. I didn't read the error. Classic case of not reading the error. npm run build. If you were watching that and you knew I was doing it wrong, apologies. There we go. npm run sitemap, blah, 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 generated index sitemap. So in public now, we've got the sitemap, we've got Example, blah blah, that's what we put in our config. And we've also got this robots. Very nice. Only issue being, public is the place to be if you're using Next.js's server, dynamic site. But if you're exporting, if you're exporting a static site, you don't use build and then run or start even, you use export. So let's see what, what fireworks go off now. There we go. So now, out, and look, we've got no sitemap in, out. So now, if I was to run npm run dev, and then hit the refresh, boom. You got sitemap, you got one little sitemap and then you've got this one. I'm not sure exactly, I'm not too familiar with how sitemaps should be laid out, but I'm assuming this chap has done the, done the correct thing. I'll have to look that up. So we've got it working on our dynamic server, but if I was to go into out and then run HTTP server, and then that opens a server for me locally on 80. And I go to sitemap.xml. We've got nothing. So at now, our dynamic server's got a sitemap, but our actual static site that we're going to generate doesn't have a sitemap. And that's no good. So we closed the npm page of next. Map. So we will have to Google it once more because we need to look at those config options, don't we, to see how do we get the sitemap out of public and into out. And there's nothing so far. Out the gotta be out the the out the. So now, npm, npm, what is going on? npm run sitemap. Christ, npm run build. npm run sitemap. Ah. Okay, now we've got a successful printing. Let's go to out. 
and we've got the site map there, as best I can tell. HTTP server, I've gone to the wrong CD out again. HTTP server, start that baby up. Go back here, hit refresh, and there we go. Working. Obviously, gonna have to jig around a little bit with my deployment, my pipeline, but I will I? It might even just deploy now. No, I'll have to add in a step to, to do sitemap. That's it. No excuse for any of you chaperoonies or chapettes not to have a sitemap on your website. This is what the desk looks like from my perspective. And oh, whose YouTube channel is this? Very nice channel, I do say so myself.